Steve, thank you. Police in our area getting some lessons today about how to keep their canine officers safe in the field. News 12 Connecticut Sean McCabe is at a Newtown Volunteer Ambulance Headquarters with more. Sean. Yeah, hi, Eric. Police canine handlers were here from all over the state today, all over the southern part of the state anyway, learning techniques that could save the lives of their four-legged partners. Officers first learned about emergency canine symptoms and treatments in classroom sessions throughout the morning. Then they applied those lessons with stuffed dummy dogs applying wraps, bandages, and air masks. Finally, the canine officers themselves came out of their cars this afternoon for a little hands-on experience as their handlers practiced lifting the dogs into an animal stretcher. Officers say it's hard work, but their partners deserve it. I mean, these guys put a lot of time and effort into training. These dogs have well over 800 hours of just basic training in them, and, and I think they deserve a lot um, you know, because they're, they're here for community and they're here for you know, people's safety. So they work a lot, and all they ask for is just a ball, a treat, and that's it. Now, Officer Fiegel there says she hopes she never has to use what she learned today, but she, if she does, she knows that her partner, Eris, will be in good hands. In Newtown, Sean McCabe, News 12 Connecticut.